first of all welcome everyone so I'm back with another vlog and I've just been running ragged okay this is just one of those days where <clears throat> it's just a lot been going on not just today these past couple of days okay the air has not been working correctly so I guess the batteries were low. I called the apartment complex to come do it. They usually do everything the same day. That did not happen. So I had to go get my own batteries. Anywho, I did that. I went to get the batteries. Um, had some other minor issues, but God is good. Um, my car, my car started shaking. I put some bad brand gas in my car just because I was on like nine miles and I was like, oh, let me hurry up and put some gas. And I went to Quick Trip, knowing I usually um, I use Shells, Exxon, stuff like that. And I went to Quick Trip, and I did that, and that was a no-no. That's a no-no for y'all that have um, older cars, um, and you use premium because I do ha I have a Lexus, an older Lexus, but um, I have to use premium. So you, because I it's a V6 engine, so I keep that going. Literally, don't switch it up stick to the same gas okay because i had to go to walmart get a treatment all those types of things but let me tell you why i say god is good because um every week um before the, the new year so that's what four fridays in a month this month um my family were fasting so it was laid upon my spirit to do um persevere um and that is to keep pushing stay motivated whatever you're going through get through it and um literally all of a sudden everything hit hit and then you know it's christmas so i wanted to do some um pick up some extra shifts during the week for work a look and then i have um like some inspired things and then i was like oh my gosh soon as i want to do something here i find out this is expired all these things so i kind of went into like a like upset like whatever like and i just was like i'm not worried about it Excuse me, but I gave it a couple hours like I usually do. I have to let things just like, okay, give it a minute. And I got back to it. Got on my business, figured it out, figured out what was wrong with my car, what could have happened. I did the treatment, put some better gas in there. Everything's fine. Um, all I needed was a TB test. Cool, that wasn't hard, not difficult. You know what I'm saying? So. God is good. So I don't want to rant too much. I just want to share that with y'all. Um, just persevere. Whatever's going on, push through it, y'all. Push through it. Because sometimes when you get really, really close to things, it's just the enemy doesn't want you to, like, do it and do it well. So keep going. I'm going to show y'all dinner. Literally, I put the roast in the oven. And my auntie just came to get us um, to go to the like to the to the shops and stuff, Bath and Body Works and all those things. So we all just hung out, and my grandma's here. So we went to do that, and we went to the store, and I got an onion, definitely like onions in my roast, and I got some potatoes. So I'm gonna show y'all. Okay, so I just put the small these the little mini red potatoes. Uh oh, mini red potatoes. Um. And just cut up some onion. I really like onions, so I just cut them however. Because they're going to, like, you know, shrink anyways. And this is like a beef roast. A small one, just enough for me and Dylan to eat off of. So, all right. All right, y'all. So, here's the green beans. Um, I turned them off. But that's just garlic in there. Garlic. Let me take them off the eye. Garlic and I use the I can't believe it's not better spray. Spray one. Oh, and the garlic that I use. It's the kind. And this is the roast. Oops. I know the lighting. Okay, let's see. Those are the little red potatoes and the onions and stuff. Some bell peppers would have looked so good on there. I like bell peppers also, but this is just a quick little meal. All right. Yes, yeah, so I have to grab a tree. Um, Dylan hasn't really said much about a Christmas tree, so I literally just, I didn't think anything of it. I really, 
I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Like, a Christmas tree. Uh, it is what it is, you know? Like, I can't even explain it. Like, I'm just not... I, I don't care if I have a tree or not, you know? But being that he's six, um, I asked him. And he was like, yeah, yeah, I want a tree. So, um, I'm just going to go ahead and get a tree. So, when he comes home from school, we can set it up and everything. Um probably going to be like something very reasonable because I'm going to throw it away. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to keep it because all the really good sales are after Christmas and I want a really, really nice tree. You get what I'm saying? So being that I'm so late getting a tree, yeah, we're already what? Six, seven, six days into Christmas, well not Christmas, December. <sighs> so I feel like I, feel like I got a late start. Um, yeah so that's just that but whatever we'll just get a tree and we'll decorate it um dylan won't even be here for christmas so he's either going to maryland or california i think more towards maryland um just because all of his uncles are there and um he just seen my auntie and my grandma um they were here for thanksgiving so he probably wants to go to maryland i'm pretty sure but um yeah so i'm gonna grab grab a tree uh, maybe get a couple of other things while i'm in here so that's it. I'll be back. Okay, y'all, so I need help finding what I'm looking for. Not the access guy. Hold on. Hello, sir. Um, I need help locating this tree here. I don't see it over here on this wall. Is there another location? Uh, no. If we have them, it'll be over here. Oh, okay. Yeah, from the 25th to the second. Which one is that? It is the uh, holiday time pre lit. Mm. Is this something I can click on for a number? No, I could just. Uh... Okay, y'all, so I definitely should have been recording, but I'm making French toast. Uh, while I was at the store, I did go get some brioche brioche bread. And um, there's a lady I watch. Um, her name is Fran. I'll put her um, channel. But, she, okay, so Fran, <laughs> I love eggnog, okay? Fran told me that she... Not me, <laughs> exactly, but her channel. She was vlogging and she said that she made French toast with eggnog. And I was like, oh my gosh, I have to try that. So I beat up um, two eggs and some eggnog. And then I'm just like soaking it in there in the mix. And I did put some cinnamon and a little vanilla extract. And then I'm just, I know I didn't get the lighting the lighting isn't that great. Sorry. So, so sorry. I'm trying to capture it, but yeah, that's what I'm doing. So, I'll show you what it looks like, though. All right. These are the eggnog, eggnog, <laughs> eggnog French toast. Boom. Thanks, friend. What? You don't like to make it. Okay, you do the Christmas tree and I be the cutter, okay? Whoa, I know.
the street. We are not a Okay, you ready? Ready? Three, two, one, cut, go. It means go. Why is it a talk? When I say cut, it means you can talk. Hold on a second. Uncut.